guys we're back with another video if you're new here welcome if you've been here before welcome back <laughs> we are here at the deserted village today um we are in warren my words lord have mercy so well, this building that we were just in was actually um a church slash store slash <laughs> post office um from what i understand the bottom floor was like i think like the churchy part or the post part uh, it confused me a little bit reading it um i know i said one of the upper levels was the post office but let me see maybe i just want to show you guys the porch if you haven't been here before this is a good hiking trail if you haven't been here before just on a rainy day like today not as nice but we're doing it there's a little light on in there there's people that come and obviously like maintain the property um, there's no light in here yeah um i think they do private tours actually not 100 percent sure but definitely something to come check out if you are interested in it, Elise was taking a couple pictures and I noticed there's actually a pathway down here. So let me show you guys real quick. There's a pathway down here. We're, so the building I just showed you guys is right here. But you walk down a little further. There's a historic cemetery. I think me and Elise, we are... Oh, oh. I think me and Elise, we definitely are going to go and try to see what we catch on that. Um, see if we see any movements or anything over there. But I want to show you guys the other buildings that they have here. And then we'll come back this way and show you guys. So, uh, we put some bug spray on. <laughs> Release has a... Half the can she, look at her. Look at her arm. I'm glistening, Wait, baby. She is shining. And I touched her arm. And we were doing a thumbnail. <laughs> I went like this. My lips are numb right now. Oh like, God. it feels like I put lip, pl lip plumper on. <laughs> Wait, right. what does it say? Let's see what we got over here. Oh, maybe we can find it here. Maybe it says a little something, something. Oh gosh, this feels horrible. Are you sure you're not gonna die? <laughs> oh, they have a a camping site. Mm. They have a K9 cornfield. Wait, this goes all the way to like Duke Farm. You know that, Matt? Oh. Bar Mask up. The Duke Farm barn ruin. Yeah. Be careful when you're coming on these trails and you're walking in like the tall grass for ticks. They are not fun to remove. Every time. Every time I'm filming. Everyone disappears. Erlise, where the heck she's going, all I hear is there's a sign. And then she just disappears off into the trail. Oh my god. Alright. Let's see. I think walking in these trails, I'm always afraid to get, holy crap. Tent. Woman! <laughs> Spiders. Oh, what the hell I just heard there this huge field I feel like I'm in twilight so I think when we just walked through it said from what I can tell it looked like it said tents but I don't know this would make sense a little campground I wonder if you could like grow here or at least it's like a freaking spade demon <laughs> so the way I was gonna walk originally was kind of the same pathway to the other historic houses they have here but we walked through the little camping section of it give you a little little more insight of this trail I guess
Hi, cutie. Hi. Whoa, look at those houses over there. You think we can get inside one of them? Uh, I don't know. But I want to take a look at that. Look. Zoom into that if you can. How badly decayed that ceiling is. That porch. The bottom, too. It's all caved in. There's chains on it, so we can't really walk to it, like walk on it, but I'll try to give you guys the best view I can. I try to go inside. I was just looking at that door like, oh, I want to open it so bad. That one had a door open, but it, I'm like, I think it says no trespassing for that reason. What does the back look like? Well, that's poison right there, I think. Now, personally, I would walk on that porch. Number one, it's raining, uh, so it's very wet the wood on top of it. Um, there's a lot of poison ivy there. I've gotten poison ivy, poison sumac before. Oh my God, the worst. So I don't have long pants on right I have some shorts on because it's very humid and I don't want to risk walking through that right now. I don't even want to see if it is. So. The house that I showed you before has a chain on it, but you can see like the doors and dead bolted or anything. You can clearly see like it's open. This is technically like owned by the uh, government. Like this is, I guess, what is it? Government property. Um, like I'm tempted because it's open. I can see it. I can see it's open, but I'm not going to because I ain't trying to get fined or arrested today. But, If anything lives under here, yeah. See, it's open. Has that one has a? Ow! Ouch! This is why you wear long pants. Ow! Looks like somebody threw rocks up there or something. Get a better angle. Yeah, I know. Rip to whoever walks on that. What I like about the trails is when they have, um, like, the roots of the trees are kind of like a stairway. Yeah. Like, let me get down here and I'll show you guys. Kind of like that almost. For people who go hiking a lot know what I mean. Look at that drop. That drippity drop drop. <laughs> Doesn't look that bad on camera. But let me show you. Like from here, Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. This girl is walking into craziness. Let me see. I, did, I was not paying attention to where I walked. I might have stepped in poison ivy. I don't know. This kind of reminds me of the asylum we went to last time, where the ceiling had kind of the wooden floors and was open like that. It's like a crawl space. Hmm. What's happening? <laughs> We're on the mountain, girl. Oh. <gasps> This looks like something that would be in the basement, but you obviously see the fireplace there. It might be something they added 
after they found this village. Yeah. Disclaimer, just what I showed you, um, we did not go inside from what it looks like. Maybe kids or other kids came here, broke the windows, like took down the boards. Clearly every house says like, uh, what is it, federal, no trespassing, like government property. Um, and if you're caught going in there, you can get fined, possible imprisonment or don't a record. Don't tag, don't graffiti, don't do nothing. As much as we like exploring abandoned places, I think with how many signs they have up, it's very clear. And you want to respect it. Yeah. Oh, fuck. You saw what that was over there? What? what? It looked like a fucking uh, little fox or something. Oh, shit. And ran over there into that little shed. Oh, motherfucker, fucking bug. Bitch. You're fucking scared me. Okay. Everything's fine. I at least found something over here. What is it, lad? Show me. Show me. Ooh. Ooh, it's fresh wood, too. Ooh, guys, if you ever have something, you know, or if you ever don't have anything to do, come burn some wood here. Got some firewood over there for you guys. Here we are. Got all this wood area by you. Pretty empty space. Let me uh, look over here and show you guys. Whole bunch of space. So it's getting pretty late. Um, we came a little later in the evening. We didn't expect to stay the whole time till it was gonna get dark like this, but we're gonna go to the cemetery now, which to be honest, perfect timing. Nighttime going to a cemetery. I, I think it worked out pretty good. Oh crap, I almost fell right now. <laughs> crap diddly. <laughs> crap diddly. Almost fell. Give me your hand, I don't want you to fall. Do we know hmm. how to go? Do we go up or do we Up fall? there, I see something. Okay. Oh, it's thundering. Oh, I love this weather. Good thing we didn't go the other way. We would have been lost. Yeah. Oh, shit. I'm going to myself. <laughs> so it's the Willicks and Badgley's Family Cemetery. You want to shine a name on it? Just to give you an example, let's go up here. So what we're gonna do right now, um, it's raining right now. It's getting dark pretty quick. I think we'll manage getting back. I remember the way. I remember the way, but um, <laughs> let me stand somewhere so I can rain. It's thundering. You can't hear it, I think, at the camera, but it's thundering over here. Um, Air release is gonna turn on. We got something new, actually. So we had the EMF reader. I think we forgot to bring it this time, um, but we have something different. So on the phone, it's this app that it detects any movement. So it can detect us. It can detect something that's in our presence. So we'll see what we catch on that. Okay. Right. That looks like a little tiny person. Oh, it showed up like if somebody was sitting on the the. Want to walk a little closer? The log. Sorry guys, it's raining right now, so me and Erlisa, really hard. we're trying not to get a, I actually lost my plastic bag coming up here to cover my camera. <laughs> our device is just getting too wet. We're trying to stay under the trees, but our camera's it's not are waterproof, so we don't <laughs> want to risk it. It's not working for us. But thank you for joining us today, and we'll see you guys on the next tour.